10 incredible structures built underwater. Jules Undersea Lodge. Located in Key Largo, Florida, the Jules Undersea Lodge started its existence as the La Chalupa Research Laboratory in the early 1970s. It has been an undersea lodge for the last 30 years and entrance is by scuba diving only. Don't worry, you don't have to be certified to get access to this lodge, which is 21 feet underwater. The lodge offers a three-hour scuba course so that visitors can safely get to the location. Compressed air prevents the structure from flooding and it also looks like a reef from the outside so that wildlife can still have a place to settle. Itha Undersea Restaurant. Itha is an underwater restaurant located about 16 feet below the surface that opened in 2004. The restaurant's anticipated lifespan is only about 20 years and is located at the Conrad Maldives Rangali Island in Alif Dal Atal in the Republic of Maldives. The restaurant's capacity is only 14 people and the structure is about 16 by 30 feet and offers a 270 degree panoramic view of the ocean floor. Entrance to the restaurant is done by a staircase that is located at the end of a jetty so no diving or swimming is required. The Otter Inn. The Otter Inn isn't very glamorous, but it is one of the first underwater structures that is still functioning today. In 2000, a Swedish man by the name of Mikael Genberg built the Otter Inn at Vesteris, Sweden, as a way to make art available to the public. Located a little over nine feet under the surface of Lake Mollegren, guests can sleep in a bunker, which has panoramic views of the underwater area. Genberg will even deliver dinner to guests. Reservations book way ahead in advance, and the summer months are the most popular time to stay in the inn. Sub-6. Sub-6 is the first underwater nightclub located in the Maldives and submerges into the Indian Ocean. The nightclub sits a little over 19 feet below the surface and is located about a quarter of a mile off of the beach. The nightclub is owned by Niyama Resorts and has proven to be one of the most popular nightclubs in the area. With ultraviolet lighting and hip interior decorating, people of all ages can enjoy the nightclub with panoramic views of the surrounding ocean. Poseidon Undersea Resort. Conceived and developed by U.S. Submarines Incorporated, Poseidon is a proposed chain of five underwater resorts that first gained media attention in 2008. While there has been a lot of hype over these underwater habitats, construction keeps getting postponed for what we assume is due to engineering and architectural difficulties. The plans include a 22-room building with a library, spa, and 1,200-square-foot suite. Breaking ground is still anticipated, and people can be added to a mailing list for advance reservations on the company's website. Aquarius. Aquarius is one of the last underwater research facilities in the world and is located off of the Florida Keys. The structure is owned by Florida International University and is only used by their research students who can stay there 10 days at a time. The structure can house six people at a time and is located about 120 feet below the ocean surface, making it one of the deepest underwater structures in existence. There is air conditioning, refrigerators, plumbing, and even internet access. Tektite. Tektite was founded in 1969 by four aquanauts for the purpose of training astronauts for long trips to space. Located in Great Lambshire Bay, St. John, U.S. Virgin Islands, the original four aquanauts stayed in the metal structure from February to April of 1969, and a second Tektite project came around in 1970. The second project facilitated about 11 different missions where 53 astronauts spent two to three weeks in the structure as part of their training. Both structures featured bunkers as well as a research base. The facility is no longer functioning, but has been immortalized into a museum. Hydrolab. Hydrolab was conceived by the National Oceanographic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, as a research base for scientific study of the Atlantic Ocean. The structure was located off the Virgin Islands about 131 feet deep underwater on the ocean floor. It was a small space, about 16 feet long and about 8 feet tall, with running water, bunks, and viewpoints to observe the ocean. Hydrolab eventually closed in 1986 and now resides at the Museum of Natural History. Water Discus The Water Discus Hotel is still in the planning stages, but already is proving to become one of the most incredible underwater structures in history. Designed by Deep Ocean Technology, it will be located in Dubai and will feature 21 luxury rooms underwater along with a beautiful lobby and scuba diving lessons. 
There will also be an above water structure as well for those who don't wish to go below the surface of the water. Plans were announced in 2012 and is becoming one of the most anticipated hotel openings of the decade. H2 Ohm. H2 Ohm is the first conception of an underwater home where people who have a lot of money can pay the company US submarine structures to build an underwater dream home. The homes will be two stories with two bedrooms, 600 square feet of space, a dining room, and a lounge, all sitting around 60 feet below the ocean surface. The homes will cost about $10 million each, and interested buyers can be added to a waiting list. Of course, there will be windows and special feeding technology to encourage wildlife to pay you a visit.